with bricks, with bricks, with bricks. Relax with bricks, with bricks. Relax. Have a wax. Relax, will you? Hello, Afrowax. Uh, can you even believe it? It's a uh, one year anniversary. Ah, oh. ah. Oh. A year ago today, since I uh, began the madness that is Relax with Bricks. Um, so without further ado, looks like we've got a big knoll today. Um, so let's crack on with bag four. Another person. Well then, um, what an exciting day. But let us begin, as always, with our minifigures. Uh, this is our uh, suspected veterinarian. Ooh, doesn't mind his shirt. Um, oh, this is marvellous. Look, he's got, he's got Hairy Mary's face. Mm, might get Hairy Mary. Where's... Oh, yes, I, I, I can see. Hang on, let me get Hairy Mary. We can do a direct comparison. That's a tremendous head of hair, isn't it? Absolutely tremendous. Uh, let me get down, Hairy Mary. I can just point, point to Hairy Mary. Up, up, look, can you see? Hang on, let me get the... Ew. Hairy Mary. Oh, this is good, isn't it? I knew I knew I was right to get one that had a super extension. <laughs> still going. Still going. Look, could probably even go further. Thank you. Uh, maybe, maybe the uh, the twin. Uh, the twin brother of uh, Hairy Mary, let's say that. Anyway, what's your name? Let me think about it. You're called Terry. You're called Terry. Thank you. Or Terence, uh, if you want to be more formal. Thank you. Welcome, Terry. Uh, we have some short legs. We have some short legs. Oh, so sorry. <laughs> Don't want to point it down there. Um, we have short legs and a and a... And a little top with uh, a cat on it. Mm -hmm. I mean, oh, oh, now look, we can have sad face, or we can have fear my my rabbit's not going to die face. Well, obviously we'll have that face. Oh, watch out, little Sue! You've got uh, you've got competition here. Um, now, what's your name? Um, what's your name? I think you're called Toots. Toots, absolute bitch. Excuse me? Who? Was that you, little Sue? No. Unacceptable. Well, she's cute. No, she is. There we are. So that's Terry and Toots. Terry and Toots, right. Uh, let me get up the googly eyes. The googly eyes. The googly eyes, googly eyes. Right, uh, Eric Oswald uh, says, when you gave, when you gave your, oh, let's look at, should we, should we have another look at Eric Oswald? Come, come forth, Eric Oswald, come forth, our new minifigure. 
he has arrived. There's more on the way, by the way. Don't you worry. Uh, oh, will you look at him? Look at Eric Oswald. Look how dapper he is in his little waistcoat with his fob watch. And uh, he's got that he's he's got that's not as Kitford Obert suggested a disembodied head. It is a BAFTA. A BAFTA. A BAFTA. Uh, I'd like to thank the Academy. Yep, that's that one day that dream could be yours, Eric Oswald, but isn't that a magnificent minifigure? Absolutely magnificent. Um Eric Oswald, when you gave your Alexa command, my Alexa said, sorry, I don't know that. She then proceeded to yammer on about something she did know, so I had to tell her off. I mean, this, I mean, the, the temptation is now too great, isn't it, for me to tell your Alexas to buy my books. <laughs> what do you mean you haven't read my book? What are you, what are you talking about? Alexa, buy Wilma Tenderfoot and The Case of the Frozen Hearts. What? Shh. What? What is she doing? She's, she's robbing us. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, Gary Blair, someone's mowing the lawn. Is that code for the timer on my love eggs has just kicked in? Not even honouring that with a, with a uh, response. Goodness sake. Goodness sake. Uh, uh, you know, I'll be perfectly honest, Gary Blair, my love eggs have been puffing dust for quite a while. Puffing dust. Uh, by the way, I'm planning a half-time show today. Uh, and... I will give you a little a little sneaky um, idea of what it's going to be. But if I just say to you that uh, Rosie Lee has very much uh, pulled the goods out of the bag, she's 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 done a sort of a, a mash up uh, to the for the Afawak anthem. Do you remember the Afawak anthem? I mean, I would sing it now, but Rosie Lee has sort of put it to music. Um, so anyway, I, I, I'm hoping I will be able to film that later today. Um, so that's the, well, that's the plan at least. And Wild Renaissance, you'll be very pleased to know, and I would have done it today, but uh, I've got to do, um, the halftime show today. But Elbsack, your Elbsack, you are going to be drawn uh, tomorrow. That is the plan. I'll put that up a bit too high. I mean, I'm not sure it matters, but come on, let's do it properly, shall we? She said. She said. <laughs> let's do it properly. Eric Oswald, I love the roof with the skylight over the filler up station. Yes, it's absolutely delightful. By the way, I completely forgot to put some uh, grills grills there and there but I sorted that uh, out in my own time uh, you'll be pleased to know sorry it went on a bit yesterday but it just got to the point where um, it sort of didn't make any sense to, to stop because otherwise today's build would have been approximately two minutes long to be honest um, voila la la, voila la la la, where's that, there it is, I'm just checking I've got this in the right place, yeah I do believe I have, oh look at that, I got it right, <laughs> who'd have thunk it, and on, and on anniversary day too, fooey, fooey, okay, lovely. Um, Eric Oswald, one of Raquel's googly eyes has fallen, and I seem and I see Dame Dawn is still on the pedestal. Don't you worry, uh, she's very much off the pedestal. <coughs> no, <coughs> no, and Raquel's eye has been returned. Thank you, thank you. 
Okay. Uh, nur, 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 Reen Cullen. Uh, on hearing, I can only assume this is on hearing the news uh, that I have purchased um, some uh, non Lego sets uh, from that are made in China. That there are, there are actually, uh, when you start delving into this world you discover that actually there are loads of of brick connecting um companies that aren't doing knockoffs of of lego they do they do they're doing their own sets it's not nearly as bad as you think it is. i mean there are some people doing lego knockoff sets obviously that goes without saying but um and i don't say this lightly some of them look absolutely brilliant and also i think as i said yesterday there are some firms that um take rejected lego ideas uh, sets and then make them and that's no bad thing so anyway we're op we're opening up our uh our eyes and accepting all the bricks well we'll give it a go if they're rubbish then we'll knock it on the head but they might not be they might be really good so prepare yourself anyway Noreen Cullen says and I guess you'll be helping the Chinese drug barons so that's nice <laughs> Noreen Noreen <sighs> oh no oh no it's squeaky brakes me <laughs> If this is, I want you to know, Dawn, is, is this you? Is this you leaving messages on the Google Eyes as squeaky brakes? Squeaky. Is it? Mm -hmm. Are you going to answer me or are you just going to stand there singing? No, off you go. No. No. No, you can't go on the pedestal. Absolutely. Anyway, Squeaky Brakes says, uh, do I have my own entrance alert now? Press 1-1 one, one for Squeaky Brakes. Oh, God. This is never going to end. I mean, obviously, the uh, prime culprit for this. If it isn't Dame Dawn French, it's almost certainly Kit for Dobert. Yes, the Jacuz. Jacuz. Or, of course, it could be our other uh, resident troublemaker, uh, Mr. Gary Blair. Uh, I wonder if either of them will confess. Of course, they won't. Uh, Gary Blair said, today's halftime show was fabulous. There wasn't one yesterday, you boinger. You boinger. You boinger. Uh, great to see the return of Berriman's massive organ rising up at the start. Could have done without Parry's candid shots. Mind, always be careful when standing in front of mirrors. Lesson learned, eh? But it, there wasn't even, there wasn't one yesterday, Gary Blair. We thought she was from Canada and then we didn't think she was from Canada and then it turned out she was from Canada. It's Jelly and B. Super well done with the live stream memory. Very fun and watched it again this morning. Oh, God bless you, Jelly and B. I'm so glad you were able to join in. That was super, wasn't it? Oh, by the way, um, I, I think I was planning and I had promised to do this today that I was going to film myself face on uh, because it was a special day. And I just want you to know that I, I ordered, uh, I have ordered a, um, uh, a more professional webcam for the purposes of uh, all of this hoo-ha. 
Um, and of course, uh, it hasn't arrived in time. Kill surprise. Kill surprise. But anyway, I, I was planning on doing today face on. I'm trying to work out actually, and uh, you can help me with this. Is um, now does that go? No, it goes here. Is whether you want to see me in vision as I'm building or whether you would prefer it just to be on the Lego. You tell me. Because I don't think I can do both, if I'm being completely honest. I think it has to be one or the other. I, ca I can't see any way around that. Um, but maybe we, we can have a go when the new uh, webcam arrives. And we'll see what I can do with it. Well, anyway, we'll, we'll work it. We'll work it out. We always do. That's what we do in the Effort Work gang. We work it out. We work it out together. Together. We work it out. Well, that was a nice song, Emma. Whoops. Uh, of course, I haven't got Twitter business up and running. I taunt, please. Oh, Kelsa, please. Oh, yes, you can. Little Sue, we haven't got to you yet. Just just pack it in, will you, please? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, pack it in, little Sue, pack it in. And then it's all like, oh, little Sue, can you cover while I'm getting Twitter business up and running? Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, well done, little Sue, well done. Well done, I've got it up and running now. Thanks. Thanks, little Sue. Oh, thanks, little Sue, thanks. Thanks. Oh, talking of little Sue, little Sue, she's called little Sue. She's little, she's called Sue. It's little Sue. Hello, it's me, little Sue. Hello, little Sue. How are you doing? Yeah, yeah, I'm doing all right, thanks. Anyway, what can I do for you today? Well, uh, I just wanted to know uh, how your head was uh, the morning after live with live and breaking. That, cause that was a big old glass of wine you had during that that build. It was a big, it was a big one, wasn't it? Well, yes, it, it was a, it was a, it was a Georgie Gibbon special. Uh, it's it, it's it's a, it's like two glasses in one, really, isn't it? It's a, it was a tumbler, a tumbler of of wine with some ice in it. Um, but yeah, it was uh, it was it was considerable. Um, but in in answer to your question, but it was a special occasion. Uh, in response to your question, uh, I felt a little bit tired, and I'll I'll say no more about it. I just felt a little bit tired, little Sue. Yeah, I bet you did. You're all right. You're all right. It was a special occasion, little Sue. Crikey, Moses! What are you, some sort of? Prohibition or something. <laughs> uh, Professor Lago, uh, the octan sign. Mm, the octan sign, you say? The octan sign. Ooh. Ooh. The octan sign. The octan sign. Thank you, Professor Lago. Um, it has history in the Lego world. Before 1992, Shell were the face of fuel in Lego City. Octan took over in 1992 and have maintained control ever since. The company also played a significant part in the first Lego movie. It's nice to see it in the modular as well. Shell's presence has not been eradicated from Lego entirely though. As one of the main sponsors, I believe I'm not a racing person myself, of the Ferrari F1 racing team, they tend to make an appearance any time Lego does a licensed racing set. As Lego like to avoid political and religious statements, we've yet to see a Shell oil spill set. <laughs> Needless to say, such a proposal in Lego ideas would not make it past the final Lego say, even if it did receive 10,000 votes. Thank you. 
Thanks for that, Prof. Thanks. Thanks for that. Hang on a minute, and then we'll get to Pink Lady. Oh, this is going to be a nice colour, isn't it? I love this colour. We've had it before, of course, but I like it a lot. Do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Hang on. Okay, all right, sorry, but I, I had a minor panic then. Thank you for coming to my minor panic. Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. It was only a minor one though. It was tree, tree minor. Oh, ooh, 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 ooh. Kath Pearson, I'm gonna try and, ooh. Ooh, there we are. Um, hmm, what have I done with Kath Pearson's set? Maybe I took it indoors. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to try and get that out to you either today or tomorrow, the set that you won in, in Live and Bricking. Uh, Pink Lady, uh, thanks so much for the hilarious live show. It was worth all the incidents and accidents it took to get there. I think once a month sounds brilliant, but happy to have them as often as it suits you, Mother Goose. I, or I almost certainly think it's, it's a once, once a month, don't you? Because then it feels special and it's something we can uh, look forward to. And I think if we did it, to, if we did it too much, everyone would, no one would be even remotely bothered. No, they have to feel like a special occasion, I think. Do to do, and also it's nice because then we can we can do set giveaways and things and make it exciting, give it a sense of occasion. Oh no, oh 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 Triggs, Triggsy, Triggsy. Oh, how does this work? Oh <laughs> no, that no, that's all wrong. That's not, that's not right. Oh, Lord above, my spatial awareness has gone into overdrive. What? Oh, that's because it's like this. Oh, okay, right, I've got it now. Okay, I've got it now. Uh, no, need, no need for further panic, uh, Mr. Graham Triggs. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Graham Triggs. Thank you. Really? Really? Full week! Full week! Full week! Uh, Rosalie, all hail Mother Goose, uh, live and bricking, was so much fun that I had to watch again. It would be wonderful to have it once a month, but I'm happy to go with whatever you or the other works decide. Well, we can have a poll. Let's have a poll, Professor Lego, please. Let's have a poll. How often do you want uh, live and bricking? <gasps> Thoughts from an architectural historian. Oh, joy. Thoughts from an architectural historian. The streamline canopy is glorious and represents a real relic of the golden age of motoring between the wars. The petrol pump is perfect. These were introduced to England in 1919 with filling stations widespread here by the late 19. 20s. Oh, thank you. Mm. Thank you, Pink Lady. Thank you, Pink Lady. Uh, Angie, uh, Angie Wood. Uh, oh, I can't apologise enough, but here we go. Yippee! Absolutely loved Leven Brooking and was giggling from beginning to end. Definitely a triumph. Lung me mother gooseween. I mean, I can't apologise enough. I can't apologise enough. Uh, Hannah Forbes' uh, Live and Breaking was brilliant fun. So hard to keep up with all the banter. But I laughed out loud all the way through. Read the instructions. Absolute comedy. 
uh, water nissels. Love and breaking is a very love and breaking. It's a very different show. I think probably under specialist interests. <laughs> love and breaking. No, I mean, well, <laughs> if you want to put Jackie Swan in charge. <laughs> Woohoo! Uh, Ruth Hayes. Oh. I still, I, I still haven't got over the fact that I la la landed her. What an error! What an absolute shocker! Um, she says, "Re a uh, birthday minifigan and doodah, Brick Sabrider. You asked me to nudge you near the time, but I didn't because I didn't want to distract you from live and bricking. Anyway, I would be one happy affawak if I were to receive said treasures. Do you need me to send my address again? No, I don't, Ruth Hayes. I do believe you're now in my um." in my Affawak address book uh, that I'm keeping uh, as the to keep track of the Patreon gooses and who's had what and who who still has to be sent things, etc, etc, etc. Yeah, I will send that out to you, Ruth. Now, Ruth, you have got a choice um, because obviously there's the, 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 the Ruth Hayes minifig who sits here on the desk um, now, normally what happens for the birthday uh, send-outs is that you get a doodah and a random minifigure. Um, but if you want, Ruth, I could send you your your special minifigure, but that will mean she will leave the desk forever and we'll, we'll feature in no further films or animations. So, But it's, it's up to you. It's up to you. Um, you let me know. Professor Lego, uh, the number, just to let you know, that the number of dark grey radiator grill, 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 one times two pieces, first damage, you had at the end from step one to nine, two, you forgot to add the second pair of one times two brushes, second image, after sliding the axles into place on the truck. Uh-oh. I, I know I, f I fixed the grill, I fixed the grill, but I'm not sure I fixed the other one. Hmm. <laughs> uh, the truck does have a moving part, by the way. If you twist the visible black cog on top, you will find it raises and lowers the winch. Ooh, let's see. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, oh look, that's lovely. Mm, hello, hello, pleased to see you. Mm, not so pleased to see you. Oh, that was exciting. Oh, well done. <coughs> well done. Um, and th I think that's a good point to say uh, welcome to the halftime show. <laughs> We watch the videos by Amber and it is with great we we welcome your members with laughs and claps and laughs and apples in the cap. We all love tiling and moving parts. I don't think this song will talk a But it doesn't matter as we have Jackie's song recorder. Emerald and Lego shed, and we 
Now we built a grand emporium in yellow. Get yourself settled and pour on a brew and join a fellow apple wax and little Sue to. Hello, it's me, little Sue. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I haven't technically made it yet, but I am going to do that earlier today. I haven't technically done it yet. <coughs> Don't even know how it's turned out. Anyway, I hope it was good and I hope you liked it. <laughs> uh, Ruth Hayes says, this build just gets better and better. I'm actually swooning over the petrol pump and the roof canopy sigh. I mean, so much to say. Thanking you, Mr. Graham Triggs the Var, for your musical birthday wishes. Emma, no apology necessary for La La landing me. Just added to the enjoyment of the day. Hope Kath Pearson wasn't too discombobulated. I'm sure she was far. I'm, I mean, again, apologies to uh, to dear Kath Pearson if she experienced anything akin to uh, to alarm or shock. I mean, that would have been terrible, ter terrible, terrible business. Anyway, you will be getting your, your, your prize draw win. Don't you worry. Hope you enjoy it. Now then. Hmm. Oh, I see. Like that is it. Like that is it. Oh, like that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. All right then. Yes. Super. Now one of these. Not going there. I do believe. Uh, now where are they over here? I haven't finished with club business, by the way. Let's do some more. Um, what a renaissance. Little Sue's recites Pink, Pink Lady is brilliant. Maybe you could do an episode where you read everyone's messages in someone else's voices. I mean, <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's not complicated enough, Wild Renaissance. I, uh, I love how you want to make it more complicated. Absolutely loved Love and Breaking. So much so, I've watched it through a few times. GG coming in to tell you to read your messages and your face when you got halfway through the limerick were my personal allies once a month. Sounds fabulous. Uh, Tanya now dresses her to test her, at which point just says I'm screaming. No! I hope that doesn't mean you don't want any further live and breaking, Tanya now dresses her to test her to test her to test Annie Miller. Oh, we, we must keep welcoming Annie Miller. She's, she's a newbie. And she's a goose. Um, hang on, Annie Miller. Hang on, please, Annie Miller. Just getting myself sorted here. I'm about to get a phone call, by the way. So uh, if I suddenly scoot off and then come back and it, and it looks a bit weird, that's what's happened. Someone has rung me. They're ringing me at 9am. 9, 9 this very morn. Oh, have I got the right size? What? What? What's going on here? There it is. Uh, yeah, Annie Miller says, Today was lovely and calm after live and bricking. I would have enjoyed it more, though, if, it hadn't, if I hadn't been battling a pesky fly that was determined to land on my face. Well, as Rosie Lee says, that'll be Kenneth. He just wants to say hello, and Annie Miller says, I'm very happy for Kenneth to stay in the Lego shed. Hmm. <laughs> uh, Professor Lego. Uh, for me, highlights uh, of live and bricking had to include, one, making it to the half-time draw without placing two bricks together. I mean, can you even believe it? Guest appearances from Gigi. Well done, Mother Goose. Oh, and clearly the cat is out of the back in regards to Blaze, as seen in Exhibit A. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I, I, I will have, I won't have anyone disparage my Blaze. No, 
no 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 absolutely not absolutely not i'm fearing i'm going to get this phone call any minute any second now um right, where's this that goes there Oops, that's going on there. Ooh, that doesn't want to get down, you bugger. Get down, get down. Ooh, this is horrid. Why doesn't that want to sit there? That doesn't want to go on at all. Oh, oh, there we are, right. Oh, this is horrid. Oh, horrible. Horrible. Oh, horrible. Oh, that's because that's round the wrong way. That'll explain it, won't it? It should be like that. Graham Triggs will be literally just shaking his head. Shaking his head in despair. This is still horrible. Oh, this is horrible. This is absolutely horrible. That doesn't want to even remotely go on there. Why not? I think it doesn't even want to. Look, if that's that, that. Oh, this is horrid. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. Oh, this is actually upsetting me. It's actually upsetting me. What's going on? This is horrible. Why is it doing this? I'm aiming for the wrong. Is it this one? Maybe it's this one. Is it this one? No, it can't be this one. Right, that is correct. It clearly needs to sit there. This, this is actually making me want to cry. Has something gone wrong here? It's too short. What's happened? No, that's right. One. There we are. That's two eights. Oh no. Oh gang, this is absolutely hateful. Hateful. But this is fun to watch, isn't it? <laughs> but this is really good fun to watch. The, the phone call cannot come quick enough now, as far as I'm concerned. That just absolutely 100% does not want to go anywhere, to go on. This is supposed to go up here, but then it doesn't. No, it must be down here. Oh, this is absolutely evil personified. There's nothing relaxing about this. I'm telling you, this is nothing. And it just doesn't want to go down on any, anything. It doesn't want to go down. Okay, that's fine. Every, as you were, everybody. As you were. As you were. As you were. As you were, everyone. Oh, look. Oh, look. Oh, look. Suddenly it all works, love, beautifully. Oh, oh, look. Round of applause for me. 
round of applause. Thank you. That was absolutely horrific. Um, let's never talk of it again. Right, that's going there. Yes. Then we want four of these. Oh no. Oh this I'm having a I'm having a minor nightmare here. Have you noticed? Absolute minor nightmare. I've abandoned all club business. Right, let's get back to club business. Um Tanya now dressed says re reblaze. Reblaze. Uh, she says, mm, good job the patio's down. There might have been a minifigure under it. <gasps> and also Don't, don't even, don't even joke about it. I'll, I'll come in here and go, um, Blaze, Bla Blaze, Blaze. And Georgie will be going, are you going up that shed to see that Blaze again? No, <laughs> no, 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 don't know what you're talking about, Georgie Gibbon. No. Who, who? <laughs> I don't even, don't even. I can't even remember anyone called Blaze. <coughs> <coughs> I I love your Pearson music, Emma. Oh, hello, little Sue. Hello, hello. It's very reminiscent of Enya in the 90s. Yes, Tanya Aldresta says, I love that one too. Uh, Kath Pearson says, Live and Bricking it was a masterpiece of theatre. Even if I hadn't won the draw, I would have loved it. Happy to have as many of those in my life as possible, but we'll take whatever you can do. Uh, Bev Bratton says, the live build was absolutely glorious. I haven't laughed so much in such a long time. Thank you. Shout out to Georgie for reminding you to look at the comments or Kitford might still be in Applewhack Alcatraz. Loved it. Uh, Charlie Chops, she fights crime. She fights crime with the face hair, but not uh, exclusively from her face hair. They very much work together as a team. Um, but, but they do it together, fighting crime. It's Charlie Jobs. Hello, Charlie Jobs. Uh, Live and Brecken was so much fun. Thank you. At Katie Hall, yesterday was so much fun. You were absolutely wonderful. Oh, thank you. Uh, Alan Harwood. Welcome. Welcome in, Alan Harwood. Welcome in, Alan Harwood. Welcome in. Uh, he's not just an Afawak. He's... Of course, uh, that was when the... Uh, phone call happened. I do believe I was welcoming in, welcoming in uh, Alan Harwood. So, you know, let's give him another clap. I think your clap was interrupted, Alan Harwood. Uh, anyway, yes, he's, he's, he's new, he's a new member of the gang and he's also a goose, also a goose. We welcome you, we welcome you. Uh, and he says, I really enjoyed Live and Bricking on Saturday. Apparently my Alexa has now ordered uh, the Lion, the Witch, sorry, the Tent, the Bucket and Me on Audible, unbidden, <laughs> get in. I hope that uh, that, uh, that Emma's not one of them speed readers. No, I, I read it nicely and slowly, I do believe. Uh, but that does conclude Club Business. Look, we've got a nice bit coming up now. We've got some tile. So, yes, John Perry, we've got tiles. We've got some lovely tiles. We've probably got about probably about, about five minutes more to go today. Not really sure. I've slightly lost track of time. Oh, 
this is loveliness, isn't it? Oh, look at this for a feature. Oops. Fiddly. It's rather nice, isn't it? Voila, okay. Uh, I think that's going to be it for today. And then tomorrow I can see we've got some nice, lovely detail coming up. 
Uh, <clears throat> so we can look forward to that. Um, but there it is. Um, happy one year. Uh, relax with bricks. I suppose we should sing uh, happy birthday. Ha so without further ado, uh, Mr. William Triggs sings. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Relax with Bricks from the Lego. Happy birthday to you. Woohoo! See you tomorrow, everyone. <laughs>